Hello, and welcome back to Educator.com's Introduction to PHP course. In today's lesson, we're going to be talking about basic PHP syntax. We're going to be talking about specifically PHP delimiters, or PHP opening and closing tags, which is something uh, we learned about in our Hello World example. We're going to be talking about uh, two features of PHP language, all languages, uh, statements and comments, and we're going to learn how to properly format them and what the proper syntax is. And we're also going to talk about uh, what coding conventions are. It's a very important topic, and we'll, we'll review that at the end. So PHP delimiters, um, we already have experienced that when we wrote our Hello World example. And the delimiters are what lets the PHP interpreter know what our code is. And we've used, um, there, there, there are actually four types that are available in PHP. What we've used is the long form. As you can see here, it should look familiar. Uh, there are actually three other types that are allowed by PHP as well. Um, one is known as the script form, and the other two are known as the short and ASP style forms. Uh, the script form looks like this, and this is the opening script tag, and this is the closing script tag. So basically, you would have all of your PHP code inserted in this area in between them. And if you've worked with JavaScript before, you, these tags may look familiar to you. Uh, and this type of tag is always available in your PHP scripts. And that's opposed to the um, short style or the short form and the ASP style, which are shown here. And this, these are the opening tags for those forms and the closing tags. Um, and the reason the, the short tags and the ASP style tags are only sometimes available is you can configure PHP to allow the use of these tags or not. Uh, so for example, you can configure it to allow short tags and, not, and, and not, maybe not allow ASP tags. So actually, if we go and look at a code, uh, some code, called delim a file called delimiters.php, we can see each of these four um, types of tags in action. Hopefully, yeah, they all fit on the screen here. Um, we can see the long form that we've used before. We can use, see the script form. We can see the short form and the ASP form. So uh, we know that these two, as mentioned, are always enabled. So the code within these should run fine. And uh, sometimes the short form is enabled, and sometimes the ASP style is enabled. It depends on the configuration. So let's load the file up in our, view it in our web browser and see what happens. So we go to delimiters.php. And what we can see is that the long form and the script form worked. They output our, they echoed uh, the statements as they were supposed to. Um, the short form also processed the echo statements, so that worked as well. However, it looks a little weird down here with the ASP um, style code. And so it looks like they didn't process uh, that. It looks like the ASP style tags are disabled currently. So actually, and you can even, if you actually go and look at the source code, blow it up a little bit, you can actually see that PHP didn't even recognize the code in between the ASP style tags as PHP code and actually just printed it directly to output, which is what you can see here. It actually printed out our code. Uh, now the way to uh, enable or enable that is through a, um, a configuration file called php.ini. Uh, 